My name is Naoki Tsushima. I'm a sophomore at Nanakuma High School. We're starting our second semester today, but we actually have a brand new transfer student joining us. I'm Yuna Hayase. She's so quiet. She seems super introverted. Hey, where do you live, Hayase-san? Um, I just recently moved, so I don't really know the area. What club are you going to be joining? Um, I don't think I can do club work because I'm busy at home. We're all going shopping on Sunday, so would you want to go with us? I would love to go shopping, but I'm sorry, but I'm a little busy. Oh, um, okay. Let's go home then. Bye, Hayase-san. Yeah, bye. Three months went by and she was kind of the outcast of the class. No one talked to her. And more importantly, I feel like she's losing more and more weight. Then one day during lunch, we were changing seats and I was seated behind diagonally behind her. She started doing something suspicious and I noticed. Huh? Did she just... The next day, she put the bread in her school bag. You're not allowed to take home foods that you didn't finish or take foods for your kids that were absent because the school was afraid of liability issues and food poisoning. She's going to be chewed out if the teacher finds her. After lunch was over, I decided to talk to her when no one was around. Ayase-san! Huh? Tsushima-kun? You put that bread in your school bag, right? What are you going to do with it? I'm not threatening you or anything, but you know that it's against school rules, right? Sorry. It would have been a cool guy move for me to say it's fine, but I'm just a kid, so I didn't know what to say. Oh, yeah. I'm home! Naoki, I said you have to come home from the back. My parents run a restaurant. It's not a fancy place, it's just a quaint little spot in a busy road. Our house is on the second floor. It's too far to go out to the back. It's fine, we're not open right now anyway. You're just such a smart aleck. I wonder who you got that from. Naoki, go eat and go upstairs. Okay. I was able to eat food once I got home on days that I didn't have practice because it was right between lunch hours and dinner hours. A hamburger and fried shrimp dinner. Woo, this is my favorite! I wonder if Hayase-san is trying to eat that bread for dinner. Naoki, eat quickly, we're going to open soon. I am eating. You were daydreaming. What's wrong? You thinking about a girl? No, um, uh, there was a girl that took home her lunch bread. Maybe she was too full, so she decided to take it home. But I thought they didn't let you take home food at school. Yeah, so I was just curious. Maybe there's something going on at home. I want to help her, but this kind of thing is tough to help. Yeah, it's not that I get along with Ayase-san. We're just classmates. I was curious what was going on, but I'm sure she didn't want me to pry or anything. I'm sure the teacher would do something about it. Then one day... Hayase-san, do you have a second? Yes, sir. Hayase-san was called up during lunch and she left the class. Apparently Hayase-san was taking home her lunch. My mom's friend works at that same supermarket as her mom, but they moved because of divorce. Maybe she's starving. Huh? Really? We should have given all our extra food to her. I could hear the girls talking and my chest felt tight. Um, Dad, can I ask you for a favor? Where of you to ask for something? Can you teach me how to cook a hamburger patty? Huh? What's going on? Is it going to snow tomorrow? Shut up. How dare you say shut up to your mom? You want to miss out on dinner? Sorry. Is this about uh, that classmate from before? Yeah, but I wonder if that's just a pain in the butt? I don't really know about her either. I mean, she might be surprised. Some people might mistake it as some kind of pity, too. Pity? Is this just virtue signaling? Who cares if it is? I think it's much better than pretending nothing is going on. Right. I was gonna give it to her during lunch, but I couldn't. But it's probably super suspicious that I'm following behind her after school. Huh? When I looked back up, she was gone. Huh? Where did she go? I looked around and noticed that she was about to go into an apartment that looked like it was about to break down. Ayase-san! Huh? Tsushima-kun? Um, uh, my family runs a restaurant and, uh, hamburger? Huh? Why? Crap! I gotta come up with an excuse! Um, training. 
Yeah, I need to train for the restaurant right now. So I just wanted you to try eating it. Me? Yeah, I understand how that's totally weird. <laughs> oh, uh, a draw. I could have picked anyone, but I drew your name from a hat. Congrats, you're the lucky girl. This is really, really painful. Lucky girl. <laughs> Did she just laugh? Thank you. I'll enjoy it. By the way, this will keep going until I'm done with my training, and this is your training too! Bye! Ugh, I was so nervous. That night, I was helping around the house, and the woman showed up. Welcome! Um, I'm Yuna Hayase's mother. I heard that Tsushima-kun brought my daughter Yuna some food. I'm here to say thank you. Well, well, uh, thank you so much for coming all this way. Uh, please have a seat. I'm sorry. I know I may have caused some worry with my daughter. If only I was just a better mom, I wouldn't be putting her in this kind of situation. It's fine. I'm in the middle of trading, so I can't make anything that's customer-worthy. She's just helping me out. Now, Key, you are... So, yeah, I'm so sorry for your daughter, but would it be all right if she helped him out? We've got to help each other out, huh? Thank you so much. I made omelets this time. There might be some eggshells, so be careful. Thank you so much. Um, I wanted to thank you. No, you're just helping me out with my training. Can you help me out with my training, too? Huh? Your training? Yeah. You know how we have our midterms soon? Ah, I forgot! So, yeah. Can you help me become a good tutor by practicing teaching? Uh, I'm in a girl's house for the first time. No, wait, I'm here to study. Let's get started? Yes, please. Shoot, I said something weird because I was nervous! <laughs> yes, let's get started. She's a goddess! She laughed and messed with me back. Her smile is amazing! I'm home! You got your exam scores soon, don't you, Naoki? <laughs> Behold! Huh? 78 in language arts, 68 in English, 91 in math, 83 in science, 72 in social studies. You worked hard. You did great, but don't throw your exams. Sorry. I continued to train my cooking, and Hayase's son continued to train her tutoring. Both of us were able to get into Nanakuma High. We're going to celebrate today for your graduation. I can't believe that Naoki would get into THE Nanakuma High. It's all thanks to you, Yuna-chan. Thank you so much. It's because Tuchima-kun worked hard. You have no idea how much our lives have improved thanks to Naoki-kun's cooking. Thank you so much. Your cooking has really improved. I just can't stop eating because it's so good. <laughs> I'm glad you think that. But there's something I'm kind of worried about. What is it? I just keep gaining weight. True. I feel like her boobs have really been something else since middle school. Her buttons are about to pop open. Uh, it's okay. You don't mind, juicy girls? Of course not. Totally fine. If anything, it's a treat. Okay, great. She's so cute. Her physique wasn't the only thing that was changing. Her personality, once dark and quiet, was bright and bubbly now. It was a little upsetting that I wasn't the only person that knew that now. But you don't need to deliver me food anymore. Huh? Why? I can work part-time now, so I can help out around the house, you know. Oh, right. Thank you so much. No, thank you for helping me with my training. Crap, I'm about to cry. Dad and Mama right here. I thought that I was going to cook for her and she was going to teach me through high school. I thought this would continue, but it was just me. I bet you she's going to be popular in high school. She'll probably start dating the soccer team MVP and stuff. Damn it! Extroverts explode! W what are you screaming for? Stop screaming in the store! I want to scream and cry sometimes too! Um, Tsushima-kun? I haven't been able to make you the ultimate hamburger or omelette or fried shrimp. I have so much training that I want your help with. I'm so happy. Huh? But you don't need my food anymore, right? You said you don't. Um, that's... That's because once she's in high school, she's going to start working at our store. I told her that our waitress is going to quit, and she said she'd love to work here. Huh? I was going to tell you ASAP, but I was told to keep it a secret so they could surprise you. 
That didn't last long, though. You guys were all in on this? S sorry but I don't want to leave you. I want to see your training through, you know? Huh? Oh, right, yeah. Oh, I love the little romance going on. Ew. What did you just say? Sorry. <laughs> Ten years passed by. Yuna, hamburger lunch, table five. Sure thing. Yuna still helps me with my training, but I'm stoic, so I'll probably never finish training. That was a little cringy. Hey, stop reading people's minds. <laughs> you two haven't changed at all. Oh, you keep talking about training. How long are you going to keep her waiting? I want to see my grandchild. <laughs> We're finally on break. Honey, help me go buy some more ingredients. Right now? Yeah, thanks. You guys hold down the fort. Okay. Later. Here you go, Yuna. Thanks. Huh? I put out a small plate with the hamburger meal. On the edge with little sauces handwriting it read, Will you marry me? Yuna, I'm sorry for keeping you waiting for so long, but will you marry me? I think we can almost have our second store and... Yes! That was fast. I'm still in the middle of my talk. I was waiting so long for you, so I'm just so happy. I'll take great care of you. That day, from the moment that you made me that hamburger and brought it to me, I've been happy. The girl that took home the leftovers of my lunch caught my eye and I started delivering her food. Then she brought me happiness and joy. I'm gonna work hard so that she can continue eating good food. Hello! Thank you so much for watching! I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. See you all next time.